my god. I got so much iron. It's just stupid. I gotta make more charcoal. I'm gonna run out. Yeah, I... Oh, it's just dumb. Uh, hey, everybody. Greg Grimer here, coming at you once again from Valheim Plus. And uh, we've been doing some crypt raiding, okay? Now, crypts are no longer dangerous. Actually, the swamp hasn't been dangerous for me since I got this root armor. This stuff is amazing. If you've ever played Valheim before and you've skipped taking down abominations with some fire arrows, you are missing out. Okay, so with the poison resist on this armor, you don't have to worry about anything poisoning you in the swamps, like, ever again. Uh, but, <laughs> well, they'll still poison you, but it barely does any damage. But then also, the... Um, uh, the piercing effect will, or piercing resistance will protect you against the wolves in the mountain too. So this has just slightly less defense than like the iron armor. So I'm skipping the iron armor completely. I figure iron might come in handy. You know, I want to use that for something else later. So we'll just go right from this to maybe like the wolf armor. Yeah, I think that'll work. But speaking of the wolf armor, actually, Nebris has got an itch. And he is trying to explore mountains now already. He's like, you know what? We, we were in the swamp for a day. Time to go to the mountains. So he's crazy enough to actually go up into the mountains. And he opened up a portal that I'm going to jump through and hop hop up there and try to help him deal with some of the mountain creatures and, uh, and threats. And see if we can't get some obsidian. Maybe kill a few drakes and some wolves. And uh, and then, you know what? Yeah, I mean, if we can find some silver, maybe that. He's going to be going around with the stag breaker, hitting the ground, seeing what he can see. So roll that beautiful bean footage. All right, I'll head over to the taco portals that I don't know about. <laughs> they're they're very well guarded secret. Nobody knows about those things. I don't know about those things. What things? Exactly. That's the one on the hill. I take it. Taco sixty nine. <laughs> <laughs> Next one's four twenty. <420. laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, I should probably drink this. There we go. Welcome to the mountains. Oh, there's obsidian right here. Pff, easy. All right. All right, so we don't have bone mass killed yet, so that means we don't have the wishbones, but we do have these little guys flying. I got one. Out of them over there, that might be a dragon egg over there. All right, I'll take out some drakes over there. There's a bunch over there, which leads me to believe that might be a dragon egg over there. Oh yeah, there's one right here. They got the dragon egg. Yeah, there's wolves here. Got him. Having a good bow is a really good thing. That's an interesting sound. Did you find a golem? Nope. What'd you find? Silver ore. You found silver ore? Glad I didn't decide to build here. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, you could. Just cover it up. Oh, yeah. There we go. Oops. <laughs> Hi. Howdy. Now, this should make like a starfish design where there's like three branches that go off. Do this quick before the two star wolves get out here. And this is why we made iron pickaxes. Yep. So the dragon egg that I'm holding. Oh, what did I get here? I got drake eggs. Weird. Oh. Crap. That dragon egg that I'm holding weighs 200 pounds. <laughs> So I gotta run back through the portal and drop it off. Yeah, grab that dragon egg. Weigh 200 pounds. <laughs> you need uh, three dragon eggs, I believe, to spawn that boss. The uh, motor. Three or five, I can't remember. Normally, they're things you can't transport through a portal either, so that means you have to manually move the eggs to where the boss is. And boy, oh, does, wow. that, boy does that suck. <laughs> and since you There's can't... There's so much careful. silver here. Yeah, there's a lot per node that you find, so that was a good find. Did you use the stag breaker? Yeah. Yeah. It's not what I imagine doing right now. No. It's like, yeah, let's explore the mountain. Go two feet. And we're done. <laughs> well, we still gotta find uh onion seeds. This was all this is only half the journey. There. Where's the hut at? It's really close to us. Sorry if there's lag. I'm just going back and forth through the portal. That's fine. We're uh, mining up silver. Nice. Oh, I see it. Okay, so the problem with these things is a lot of times there is uh, stone golems nearby them. Okay, that's not stone golem. All right, I'm going to try to get in there, check, get out of there without dying. Oh, 
full. Okay, let me check. Let me check around back. I don't see a thing in there. Oh, there's a chest. Onion seeds, three of them. Nice. Did you make a friend? Ah, uh, maybe. Grabbing some obsidian. I'm telling you, this root armor is like the most amazing thing ever. <laughs> I'm inclined to agree. Something that I, I'm blown away that more people don't take the time to actually get. All right, back to mining. I hear some terrible things, but they can just you know go away. Really, that's how that works. Mm -hmm. Sure, they won't mind. When it is nighttime, we might want to think about getting out of here, though. Because <laughs> if we get attacked by like a one-star or two-star wolf, we could be in trouble, even with this armor. It's like that those fuelings, except where they run faster. Uh, all that work to make that iron sword. <laughs> We're gonna use it for maybe a day, just to piss everybody off. Off. I put a picture of us mining silver. Why would you do that? <laughs> Don't tell them where my silver is. It should, we should have a picture of us like going to like a single player world and have us killing Yogolith and be like, ah, you unleash us on the world. Oh. This is what you should expect. <laughs> silver swords, though, to max those things out, you need a lot of silver. Uh, I think the final evolution of it, like the final upgrade, takes 100 silver or something like that. Damn. Yeah. Or it takes Good thing it. I don't have to share any of this. <laughs> wow, 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 what? Oh, I'm freezing. It is night, I think. No, not yet. Well, it's, it's a quickly approaching night, oh, I oh, think. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I did. Oh, yeah, the wolves sound really close, actually. I shot it in the face. Who heard that snarl? as a cool oh, pucker factor. Is everything, uh, collected down there? Not yet. Oh no, I'm carrying too much. Carrying, like, a ton of stuff, literally. <laughs> I've got too much crap again. I can't hold all of it. I'm still processing my iron. <laughs> <laughs> I just got that going. You could just skip all of this. Yeah. Why did I even bother making these weapons? This means that we can make the Draugr Fang now. Oh my god, I wasted all my life. <laughs> so the Draugr Fang bow is really good and it causes poison damage too, no matter what arrow you use. And we need Guck to make it, which we've been getting from hunting abominations. I'm gonna spend some time on the silver, getting that smelted and getting that cape. Mm -hmm. oh, are you chancing it? Huh? Is it, I don't think it's, or is it nighttime? It's hard to tell. I think it is. I might regret this. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's night. Yeah, so am I. I should not be up here. <laughs> I'm in danger. We'll be fine. There's a workbench. I'm gonna make a second workbench. <laughs> did you finish this one? Um, no. Or yeah, I think I did. There's a hunk of silver over here. I can't actually carry if you want to grab it. I'll keep digging so you can just carry it. Get out of here quickly. Is that pretty much it? I think that's it, yeah. Alright, I'm heading to the portal. I think that's I think that's it for that vein. Well that was a success. That was interesting. That was definitely a success. It was a thing. That was definitely a thing that we probably shouldn't be doing right now. <laughs> Whatever, we found one. Or you found one and I just helped. I helped kill things and find onion seeds. Guess I'll grab some more obsidian while I'm here too. Is that like always worth getting? Ah, uh, no. I mean, just getting a healthy stockpile is a good idea, though. Just so it make arrows and stuff out of. But you know, you get a couple hundred, and you can probably be like, you know, I'm good. Oh wow, that wolf did not announce itself. How'd the armor hold up? Very well. Oh, I didn't max upgrade mine, though. I, I would say it's worth doing. Although we might just go no. straight to silver. Yeah. Although I have plenty of roots. So or not silver. What, wolf, wolf armor. armor yeah. 
That's silver armor, that's what people see it as. Skeletons up here. Wouldn't that be great if we could find a, uh, what's it, motors location? Is there a thing up here that'll give me that? No, but there's onion seeds in here. I got some good news. You got a trophy? Nope. What's the good news? Got another two hard. Oh, oh, my stag oh. Breaker. Is that so? I don't think it was this. Well, let's just take a peek. I didn't waste all my oh, luck yeah, it's right here. With, with you. <laughs> Silver vein. Uh, it's either that or I'm the good luck charm. One of them. Nah, that's probably you. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to go grab uh, our workbench friend. Okay, I'm going to fight this drake. Ooh, he hit me. But he got wrecked. Oh, yeah, trophy. A drake trophy, too. I can make the drake helmet if I get one more. Uh, We got a stone golem. Oh, crap baskets. Uh, he hasn't... Sp uh, yeah, he's coming my way. <laughs> Why did you want to attract a st stone golem? Uh, it's, it's entirely my fault. I take full responsibility. Got a workbench down, though. I'm not about to fight a stone golem right now. <laughs> not with the, the iron gear that I have. I'm gonna try rifling with arrows. It's probably gonna take all the arrows I got, though. But this guy drops crystals, which can uh, be used to make glass, like windows, like proper windows. I think it's enormous. Yep. That's what she said. <laughs> Dead. I walk, come through my portal, and I just hear like five forges just shoot out a bunch of stuff. So, when you beat Bone Mass, he'll drop a Wishbone, and that Wishbone will start kind of make you kind of like shoot energy rays off you, like a sparkle, like a, a pulse or something like that, whenever you're near something that's hidden. Like a, a, tre a chest, if like you go to one of those little, look like ship-shaped rocks or whatever, you might have it go off there, or a muddy scrap pile in the swamp, or a, or silver in the, in the uh, mountains. That's what you're supposed to use it for, but you <laughs> bypass that. <laughs> I mean, hey, this is a good, effective way of doing it. Exactly. I'm trying to figure out where the third arm went. Hey, we're... This is the second arm. Yeah, I, I cleaned up the first one. So you're not even going to search for the third one. You're just going to attack mine. I thought you were digging this way. Yours goes this way. Like, right here's one, and then over here's the other. Oh... I didn't know. I thought I found the center earlier. You, yeah, I think you did. So one went that way, one went the way you're mining now, and then the third one goes this way. My god. Is there a belt beyond Meganir? No. Why not? I don't know. And keep in mind that normally you can't move metal through portals. <laughs> so you have to manually boat the stuff all the way back to your base. Or set up a processing station where you can process it into whatever you're trying to make. It's the danger of doing this when wolves roll up because you have no stamina from mining. Uh, yeah. Oh god, that tree scared me. <laughs> I swear it's I just, still there. I swear I just fudged my huggies. Alright, walk of shame time. <laughs> wah, 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 wah. We should probably sleep when we get back to <laughs> Sorry, we're not up there at night. Oh, wow, it's already night. Yeah, it's getting there. It's close. So we actually going to sleep? <laughs> Are you sleeping right now? Uh, I can shortly. All right, yeah, it would probably be a good idea. We're just planting these uh, onions. Right, I'm going to get my rested first. I still got my ghetto bed. Yeah, me too. Ah, I had a dream. You dream of giant bouncing anime titties and awaken with a oh, smile. Oh, yeah. So I think we should prioritize wolf pelt hunting. Yeah, probably. So we need wolf heads. At least, I think you only need one, to be honest. I think that's it. But 
You might need two for one of the armor pieces. I can't remember. If I see another one of the cabins over there, broken down cabin. Sweet. More onions. Yeah, that's the idea. Could be a stone golem though, so. Except they like to be around these places. Yep, more onions. Ooh, there's a wolf. Got him. Ooh. No wolf head. I wonder if we have to use a melee weapon to chop its head off or something. Probably seen another dragon egg. Yeah, I can carry it. I'm going for it. Alright. Oh, I just stepped on some guy's fire. <laughs> Who did that? Are you are you hitting the ground again? Hey, I meant I found one. <laughs> <laughs> you found one? I'm over okay. here hunting wolves. Listen okay, you know what? No. I'm just gonna mark it. It's a nice flat spot. Oh yeah, I'm sure it's great. Just taking out wolves left and right over here. No head yet though. Yeah. Oh, I found the dragon egg. Oh boy. It's it's really heavy, so make sure you got room in your inventory. I probably don't. There it is. Oh, there's a tower. How did I not see this tower? Uh oh, is that a storm rolling in? Maybe. Yeah, we might want to retreat back then because without visibility we won't be able to see the dangers coming at us. We want to repurpose this uh, structure up here? Whatever you think is right, yeah. Yeah, we might want to wait until the storm subsides so we can see what we're doing. Alright, I'm going through the portal. It's a Drake attacking you. Oh, is he? Oh, never mind. That was a pine... <laughs> the tip of a pine tree was swaying. <laughs> well, despite only a couple of deaths, <laughs> uh, we did manage to find enough silver to actually get our wolf armor up and running, as well as kill enough wolves to get, actually get the, uh, the cape and everything. So we're way farther along than I think we should be. Because uh, we need to beat Bone Mass next still, and uh, we just recently beat the Elder. So, uh, yeah, that, that uh, Stag Breaker in the mountains to find silver totally works. You don't actually need the Wishbone. But we did also get onions. How about that? Look at that. We got some onions. Nifty. So we can actually make onion soup now. I wonder what else these are used in. After all, this is modded. Um, let me go take a look. Now, I don't really know where... I'll find this as far as where it could be. Look at all the stuff we got unlocked. We got ice cream. We can actually make ice cream, and it's actually really good. And all of that stuff. I just gotta go farm drakes. Huh. I might actually make some of that in the future. That stuff's really good. Look at that. Salmon. Oh, man. I, uh, fire ice? Uh, fire cream? Oh, you can use certainly course. Oh, it's 50-50. What's the difference on what, the healing? Three ticks. Um, four ticks. People, stop talking. I'm looking at this stuff. <laughs> Four ticks uh, to 20 minute duration. So this lasts a little bit longer. Oh, damage modifier. Very resistant versus fire. Um, you, uh, you feel you feel our you feel our cold. Okay, walking through fire feel uh, uh, actually sounds good. That sounds that's a typo. Okay, so yeah, there's also electric cream. Nifty. That's not 50 50. I don't know why you need this. If it, it says that it will zap you up uh, with a pep in your step and. Uh, or wake you up with a pep in your step and zap that uh, poison's step that poison strength. I don't really know what that is. Maybe you're immune to poison with you. Yeah, acid cream cone. That doesn't sound like a good idea. Wait, <laughs> this is this has what in it? It looks like guck. Interesting. So you can make all different kinds of ice cream. That's crazy. Uh, moochie. Okay, that that's pretty good for health. It looks like moochie time. So yeah, there's some new uh, dragon omelet. <laughs> oh man, look at the health on that thing. Almost a hundred health. Oh, six to healing. That is incredible. And you get four of them. All you need is a dragon egg. Oh, and onions. So there, there. That's what the onions are used for. Dragon omelets look like they're amazing. I might actually have to save that for like boss fights or something. 
And Buoyant Breeze, what's this? That takes onions as well. Uh, decent stamina, decent health. That's not too bad. Actually, this Dragon Omelette's so a holy cow. I am going to be looking into those for sure. Now, we do have a little bit more added to the uh, to the kitchen here. We still have our giant field of pumpkins out there. But we do have this. We have the grill going out here, which can make a couple of interesting things. Porridge. Looks like that actually might be doable. I think carrot butter takes uh, beech seeds, so that's kind of annoying because you have to go cut down a lot of stuff. But a lot of this stuff is doable to make. Uh, there's a ton of food in this mod pack now. It's kind of bonkers, actually. So it looks like onions are used in a fair amount of things. Not to mention the traditional old-fashioned, where is it, uh... Onion soup right there, which does 20 health, 60 stamina. Good for stamina. You always just make that just straight out onions, which is pretty nice. Yeah, there's so much. There's so much. Oh, wait, what was that? What was that top one? What? What? Barley wine. Oh, for fire resistance. Okay. All right. Yeah. All right. That's fine. That's a normal vanilla thing. So. All right, you guys. Uh, I think we've done enough for today. <laughs> I think we've done more than enough. We are geared up to the max. I think I'm going to focus a little bit more on building for a little while because, uh, yeah, we're good to go for motor. <laughs> we got the Draugr Fang bow. We're doing great. Um, yeah, I think we're doing pretty good. We're, we're actually, uh, I mean, I got to upgrade this armor still, but other than that, we're, we're good to go. It's kind of nuts. So anyway, I'm going to wrap this episode up, though. If you did enjoy it, please be sure to smash that like button. It would really help me out a lot. And thank you guys so much for donating your eyeballs and ear holes to this episode of Valheim Plus. I will be back next week with more. Thanks again for watching. Bye-bye. <laughs>